first there was yoga, then came hot yoga, and now goat yoga is a thing. 3 News Hour reporter Danielle Davis joins us with more on her firsthand experience with the latest phenomenon. It looks like a lot of fun, Danny. Good morning, Courtney. Yes, goat yoga is a thing, and I should say this morning, actually, Namaste. Now, it's supposed to relax you, but actually, from what I saw, it did do a lot of relaxing amongst a lot of laughing. Ready? We're just going to take our knees and we're going to hug them up into our chest nice and slow. Relax, <laughs> laugh, and hold that pose. Goat yoga is now a thing in the metro area, but not everyone, although excited, knows exactly what to expect. But just something fun and spontaneous to do, so... My friend and I decided to try it out and see, you know, what it's about. <laughs> I don't know what to expect because they're baby goats, so they have a mind of their own. And on Dittmar's farm in Council Bluffs, the goats used for class, well, they kind of help. <laughs> Walking over people, mostly being a laughable and playful distraction. Um, it appeals to a lot of people for the animal therapy aspect as far as um, getting some exercise and being outside. Um, it's just a very lighthearted thing to do. I think that people are anxious to get outside because we've been cooped up with COVID and um, it's just a fun activity to do with your friends. But there are some that take their assistant instructor jobs seriously, helping hold poses, asking for more food, and of course, well, needing to be petted. Um, that they will eat anything. <laughs> you have to leave all of your personal items outside or they will eat your keys, they'll eat your shirt and your shoes. Um, they will walk all over everything. Um, there's no personal space. Yep, and even eating anything dangling from my camera. And sometimes, well, even the camera itself. Reservations are required to keep social distancing standards. <laughs> <laughs> and the goats as well, well, they need time to prepare and warm up for the next round of lessons. Now, goat yoga is really popular. They're already sold out for September and October, but keep your eyes out as they are looking to add more classes if weather permits. This is Danielle Davis, 3 News Now This Morning. Courtney.